Hello everybody, it's Mystic, and welcome back to my library. This is episode 16 of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. And in the last episode, we finished our fight with Azala and the Reptites, and we got yeeted to 12,000 BC. So, we are here now. This is actually probably one of my favorite areas in the game, because you get to learn a whole lot more about the story. You get to learn a whole lot more about certain characters. And, um, what the hecking, Bob? Oh, that's right. But yeah, I, I really like this place a lot. So let's see. What the heck? Anything? Maybe I can't, I don't think I can do anything. No, the thing is I do love this area, but I forget a lot of what I'm supposed to be doing. So, you know, bear with me. It's been a while. I haven't played this in a few years and you know, mom brain is an affliction that I suffer from. Okay, so let's see. I don't see anything here. There's got to be something we can explore, but I don't see anything yet. I'm assuming I'm supposed to be here. Now, this is where we came from. And we got to go this way. Aha! I think we found something. <clears throat> Skyway. Hollow? Okay, well, I did a thing. Oh, and the music here. I forgot. This is probably my favorite music in the whole game. Let's just save while we're here. I did I did some extra saving last time because I don't know. I don't I don't want to lose my save. And Hasa. Do 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 do. This is the magic kingdom of zeal, where dreams can be made reality, but nothing in this world comes free. There is always a price to be paid. Do, 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 do. Welcome to Anhasa, zeal's city of dreams. We seek enlightenment within the bliss of sleep. Hmm, you are not of us, are you? Oh god, this music is so good. Anyway. You are most unusual visitors. Am I waking, or is this but a continuation of my dream? Regardless of that, I welcome you to Zeal. Her Majesty Queen Zeal rules this magic kingdom. She is without peer in beauty and grace. We owe our prosperity to Her Majesty the Queen. After the King died, she encouraged the development of her kingdom's magical prowess, which has led to great advancements. Anyway, sorry about that sound. Weird ASMR, I guess. Oh, it's that dude again. Hang on. I think this is another book to open. Do 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 do. What, dude? The world you see within your with your eyes may well differ completely from the one I see with mine. There are as many different worlds as there are observers. Never assume that only those things which you can see or touch are real. Okay, sir. It's one of these things. Do you believe in such things as fate? Do you think it is possible our lives are predetermined? Well, yes. So you're a believer too? Yes, perhaps it is arrogant to think ourselves strong enough to overturn destiny. Truth exists in dreams. The world exists in me. I'm not going to do that snoring sound again. I annoyed myself with it. All right. Um, I think that was it over here. The city of Kajar? The high seat of magical research lies on the edge of the western continent. The airship, the Blackbird, is maintained there as well. Ah, oh, yes, the Blackbird. Can I just, like, listen to this music for the rest of the day? Please and thank you? The queen has sealed away the great elemental weapons and armor for... Oh, hang on, I've got a dog hair in my eye. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Forge with the power of the sun in the shrine to the north. You can see its entrances on the northern continent, but no one is allowed to inside it now. There it is. I am Doreen. Seek the hidden path and open the doors of knowledge, each in turn. Well, I got two of them. I can't remember how many there are, though. The door to the northern shrine is sealed by a powerful force. Even we, the enlightened ones, lack the means to open it. Is that his chest? Kind of looks chesty. No? Are you a shopkeeper? 
Welcome. Have you come to do business? Probably. Um, <clears throat> we have 36. I'm going to probably get like 10 more of these. And then I want to buy a couple of high potions. Maybe 10. I don't want to spend too much of my money on them. Panaceas, Athenian water. Oh, we could use some more shelters for sure. There we go. And we need some ethers. Oh, they're so expensive though. All right. I need to save some stuff. Oh, wait, I should sell for uh, armor and, and things. All right, let's sell that. I think I could sell that. Yeah, it's lower. It's lower. Good, we can make some money back. Oh man, I had a whole bunch of stuff here that I don't even need anymore. Oh, wait a minute. <clears throat> oh, that's right. I took, I took the, um, I gotta fix that. We were all wearing ruby vests for the, uh, the, the boss, but we don't need them anymore. Um, let me see if there's anything better for them. No? Dang. All right. Is that better? It has better magic defense, so I guess I'll give it to you. Oh, I never gave her... Okay. And she's okay where she is. All right, so I can sell the... Well, you know what? I'm going to keep the ruby vest just in case. I can't remember if I need them for something. The city of Kajar, the high seat of magical research, lies on the... Wait, didn't I already talk to her? Yeah, I did. Never mind. How do I get to the other side? Oh, duh. Okay. Dot, dot, dot. Do you wish to speak? Oh, wait, do you wish to speak with us? What wrong? That animal for eat tastes good. You do not eat cats. Hmm, you look familiar, little boy. The black wind howl. The black winds howl. Gee, that sounds familiar. One among you will shortly perish. Is that true? Let me calculate the probability. Eh? Well, that was creepy. Why would he say such a thing? Strange boy, but not bad boy. I wonder what's within the Northern Shrine. No doubt the key to unlock its seal is held at the palace, but entry there is strictly forbidden in the name of Her Majesty the Queen. I think this is the last one. Yes? Or was there an order I was supposed to do that in? This is a font of recovery. Rest your weary mind and body within. Oh, thanks. Oh, I can't save in it, though. The Queen's Palace sits at the heart of our kingdom. She watches over all the world from its high vantage point. It's because of that we can sleep our days away in peace. <sighs> okay. Um, where's that little troll-looking guy? I don't remember. I, I think there might be an order to it. And I think I did it wrong. Because see how that one's closed now? Oh, here. He's back over here. This is the magic can- uh, Nothing in this world comes free. Maybe... Alright, let's try something. I think there is a, a, a pattern. But I don't remember what it is. I mean, there's only so many books I can open at once. Okay. And that one's still open. Oh, this one's still open, too. Hmm. Oh, I can't remember how this works. He doesn't tell me, either. I, I keep going the wrong way. Now he should be over here. I am Doreen. Seek the hidden path and open the doors of knowledge, each in turn. So I did, but I just don't remember if there's an order to this. Maybe I'm not supposed to talk to Doreen. All right, so hang on. Let's try. So water was open first before. Let's try wind. Like, I don't know if I'm supposed to find a book on this or what. That's water. Aha! I did it! 
Well, I mean, there were only so many patterns. Oh, hey, it's, it's that dude. I can't remember. Should I save? I'm gonna save. I hope this saves. How many times can I say save? Hang on. I mean, we have our health restored. I just don't remember if we're fighting this guy. Is the is the door still open? Oh, son of a biscuit. Okay, so wind. And then I think water. And then fire. There we go. Okay, let's go in here. Hello. The guru of reason is gone. Do you want to challenge me? Um, yes? All right, prepare yourselves. Oh God, what? what? Let's try this. Huh? Huh? What? Hmm. Well, Robo's dead. Oh no, wait, he's not. Wait, can they not? Huh. Should I not worry about hurting? Yeah, because they can't hurt us after one. All right, I'm just gonna... Oh, shoot, he can still hurt us. Well, poop. Okay, so that didn't work. Yeah, I don't remember what I'm supposed to do. Let me go heal myself. I don't even know if I'm supposed to do that right now. I probably do. Um... Maybe, hmm. I could, hang on, hang on. I've got an idea. Let's take Ayla out and take out Marl. I guess we'll leave the mist robe on because Marl can heal. So let's try this. I'm gonna have, um, yeah, I guess having Robo and Chrono out is probably the best idea. And then just have Marl on heels. Let's try this. All right, let's try Lightning 2. Marl, I need you on... Or Wait, I thought she could do... Oh, wait, Aura Whirl is... <sighs> All right. I'm dumb. It's actually not her that has... She needs Aura Beam for that. I should have just had... Okay, I'm gonna have to fix this then. Um... Yeah, because now I've got Chrono having <clears throat> having to do all of this. So this wasn't a good idea. I actually should have Robo on heels, and then I can have Chrono and who else? Yeah, see? Yeah, I think I gotta do something else here. Oh, wait! Did we do it? Oh, 
Oh, no. Can you do this yourself, Robo? <laughs> okay. Wait, tech. Yes, we did it! Robo for the win. You're strong, take this. Magic capsule, speed capsule, nice, okay. I have to decide who I'm gonna give that to. But first, let's heal. Okay, so we did that. I guess that's everything I have to do here. Do I need to talk to that old troll looking guy again? Doreen? No, he doesn't say anything new, okay. Let's save. Now, oh, there's other places to go. Land bridge, hang on. And then where does this take me? Uh, which one did I come from? This one, I think. I actually wanna go back down for a sec. Cause I wanna see, cause I know that there's people to talk to in this area as well. Or I thought that there was, but I don't see any. Like, aren't there... I thought that there were huts here of people to talk to. I could be wrong. Maybe I have to go somewhere else. All right, hang on. Let's go back up. Actually, that could be what that other land bridge is for now that I think about it. No, don't! Oh my god, Mystic! Why are you like this? Why are you the way that you are? We let's go again. It's like my kids when they get to Disney World. Let's just keep riding the same ride <laughs> over and over again. Okay. Let's try this one. Oh, and I still have to figure out what I'm doing. Oh, see, I, I was just, I was getting ahead of myself. Are these chests? No, they look like checks. Checks? Yes, they look like cereal. All right, Ooh, I think we got something here. Yeah, there's not much here. Do I wanna keep Marl? I haven't really been using her. Um, wait, what am I doing? I need inventory, speed. I actually kinda wanna give that to Robo because he's slow and I use him a lot. Um, magic. Oh, you know what? Have I ever taken Aled and the magic guy? <laughs> I don't think I can get back here now. I'm going to have to wait. Or does Ayla not know magic? I feel like she should. Doesn't she learn? Hmm. Maybe she doesn't. I can't remember. All right. Magic capsule. I think I'll give it to Marl. Okay. Yeah, I never took Ayla back there, but I don't remember if I ever had a chance to. I don't think we've gone there yet with her. And I, yeah, I don't know of a way to get back right now. So I might have to wait. Hey, Skyway. And we, okay. Yep, here we are somewhere else. There's a couple of places to go here. Small cave. Eh? I don't know what this is. I, should I? Oh, okay. Hold up. <clears throat> Let's go back down because I want to see what those other buildings are before I get too high up on this. All right. Kajar. Hello. This is the magic city of Kajar. We perform research in the magical arts to help further Her Majesty's plan to deliver our kingdom even greater glory. Your power differs from ours. It's difficult to describe, but in you, I sense a strange kindness. Those lacking magic are known as the earthbound ones. They have always lived beneath the clouds. It's only fitting. After all, they lack our talents. Well, that sounds mean. 
Oh wait, we have more of these books? Okay. My, you're, you have an unusual aura. You must possess the gift too. Yours seems very primitive. Prim oh my God. Primitive compared to ours though, you poor thing. How is it that we came to have powers we do? Why do some possess the gift while others lack it? It is a conundrum. Hmm. Hello? Oh, you just have this stuff? I already have a bunch of this. But I need Her Majesty's permission to sell it? Okay. So I've opened up fire and wind. This has got to be the other one. I don't think I opened them in the right order, though. That's the Sun Temple, which you see in the Southern Sky Isle, the Sunstone. Once our primary source of power was enshrined there. However, the temple was sealed up along with the Northern Shrine once we turned to our new energy source. The Queen claimed we no longer needed the energy of the tired old sun. That, hmm, sounds like a problem. Let me guess. Well, I already know what they're using as a power source. I don't have to guess. Her Majesty Queen Zeal has two children, Lady Shala and young Lord Janus. Lady Shala is an incredible child with, with extraordinary powers. With such a gift, her life must be all ease and luxury. Yeah, I'm sure. There's something up there. What tempest must rage in young Lord Janus's head? His only friend, other than his sister, is that cat that follows him about... Oh, I didn't mean to talk to you again, sir. I see something up there. I, I'm assuming I need to open the books in the right order. We've been seeing a great deal of young Lord Janus lately. Before, he scarcely showed his face, but now he paces around quite often, always looking upset. Whoa, what's all this? The gurus of life, time, and reason dwell in zeal. Their knowledge and skill is without equal. Zeal's progress stems from our new energy source. Its power far surpasses that of the sun's elemental energy. Yeah, well. I heard a strange prophet has come to the palace. I do not know the details, but I heard he has powers most uncanny. Hello? Sir? Oh. Oh, that capsule's not been completed yet. Too bad, eh? Ha. Huh. Oh, okay. I've been working to fashion a capsule that will enhance one's magical skill, but my precious products have dis been disappearing in recent days. It must be that naughty new that took them. They do so love pranks. He's no doubt hidden them all about. How can I work like this? Well, I found a few, and I used them. I heard Lady Shala's powers far surpass those of her mother. Then there's her brother, young Lord Janus. He's of royal blood as well, of course, but he doesn't seem to have the faintest trace of magical ability. Hello? Know you this, traveler. The moonstone could be restored to a glorious sunstone if left to bask in the sun's warm light. But such would require aeons. None of us will ever witness the glory, the go bleh, the gorgeous glow again. Well, about that. A guru once told me that the sunstone once held all of the nearly infinite energy of our sun. Over time, that energy was slowly depleted and it turned into the lightless moonstone. Hello. Water summons wind. Wind makes fire dance. Okay, so water, wind, fire for this area. Thank you. Water, wind, fire. Water. And I think this one's fire, so we gotta go... What? Oh. Excuse me. Wind. Fire. What did I do? <laughs> um. Hmm. I don't know what I did. I, I did that. Water summons wind. Wind makes fire dance. Water, wind, fire. I did that. Okay. I don't see anything different. Is there anything different? Oh, wait. Why is everything closed? Hmm. I 
I see. I thought it was gonna be something with that. All right, hold up. The construction of the Ocean Palace has fallen behind schedule. An everlasting palace beneath the waves. It'll be a sight to see when it's finished. Behold, that out the window is the great blackbird built by Balthazar, the guru of reason. To see it soar across the sky, you'd think it alive. The guru is a genius. The earthbound ones are being allowed to work on the construction of, ocean, of the ocean palace. It seems even they have their purpose. Oh, you guys are being mean. The structure you can see deep beneath the waves below is the ocean palace, a symbol of the queen's greatness. The palace is the beacon of light which will guide us to a brighter future. All praise the great and wondrous queen, bleh, queen's eel. Can I read this book? Yeah, okay. So, water, wind, fire. Now, why the book's clothes? Now, this guy just, um, Her Majesty's permission. Uh, did I talk to everyone? In ancient times, people crafted wondrous weapons and the armor by combining shards of rainbow-colored shell with the sunstone's power, but now only the guru of life knows the art of crafting such things, and even if others did, the queen has ordered us to abandon the use of the sun's power. Ah, such beauteous contentment there in is a newly in is in a newly blossomed bud. What would that would that I could be a flower? What? Okay. Um hmm. Uh, well, this is some creepy music. Hello? Why are you here? All is well with the blackbird, I presume. Uh, yes? She is fully operational, uh, operational, Lord Dalton. Of course she is, you blundering idiot. Were she not, we'd all be in trouble. You, what are you doing here? Um, I'm lost? Hmm, those clothes. You must be one of the, pro the ones the prophet said would come to interfere. I think I shall watch for the time being and see how he plays his hand. Not that I suspect he'll tip his card so easily. Ha! <laughs> uh. Okay. Um, I didn't mean to come here. I'm still trying to figure out what those stupid books do. Uh, alright, let's go back in. Maybe I need to try it again? Alright, so water, wind, fire. Wind is here. Where the heck is water? Water is down here. Water? Wind? Fire. Hmm. Wind makes water dance. What? Wind makes fire dance, water summons wind. So this should be right. I, uh, I don't know. Hmm. Like, I don't think I've seen anything change. I don't want to leave. You know what? Okay. Hang on. Give me a minute. I am going to try and find a guide for this because I feel like I'm doing it right and it should be working. So give me one second. The only thing I can think of is that... Wait. Is this... Oh my god, you guys, am I stupid? That's water. Oh my god. That's wind. That looks like water. You guys... You guys, I am so dumb. I'm so dumb. <laughs> it all began aeons ago when man's ancestors stumbled upon a shard of a strange red rock. Its power was beyond human comprehension. It cultivated dreams and gave birth to love and hate. Only time will tell how it ends. I can't believe I just did that. I cannot believe I just did that. Obtained an unidentifiable object. Cool. But inside is a black gemstone. All right. Oh my god. It's hard to tell. Like they look so similar. Uh, Cuz the 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 water one looked like wa or the wind one looks like blue waves. That's why I thought it was water. I am so stupid. Okay. Anyway, carry on.
All right. Let's save. Well, this sounds ominous. This is the Queen's Palace and the center of the Magic Kingdom of Zeal, which is to say, this is the center of the universe. Okay. The source of our energy rests deep with the deep below the sea. Once its exact location was with de determined, we began constructing the Ocean Palace there. Yeah, because that seems like a smart idea. The portal to the Ocean Palace is in Her Majesty's audience chamber. Mind you, it hasn't been completed yet. That wandering prophet is amazing. Every prophecy to escape his lips has come to pass. It's as though he already knows the events to come. Unnerving, is it not? My, what strange clothes. You must be travelers from afar. Use the font to recover of recovery if you'd like to recuperate from your long journey. Do you like plants, traveler? Absolutely. Oh, I love them too. But the queen ordered me to burn this tiny sapling I received from the guru of life. He said it was a special tree with powers to restore the earth. Oh, what shall I do? Grow it in secret. You're right. Queen's orders, throw, though they may be, it wouldn't do to burn a gift from the guru of life. Very well, then. I'll care for it somewhere, safe and secret. Someday it may help someone else who loves the earth and trees. Good. Good for you. It's another new. Hello, sir. Sir? Oh, Itchy, could you scratch my back? Sure. Oh, wonderful. Uh, oh, right there. You got it. Oh, God, this is wrong. Whew, thank you. Discovered the new scratching spot. Why? <laughs> um, that man appeared only recently, but he earned the queen's trust quickly with his startlingly accurate predictions. His origins are a mystery. He's not one of us. Enlightened ones, but nor is he earthbound. From where could he have come? Is this another book? No, it's not. Okay. Hello? Ma'am? Ma'am. Sorry. I get Oh wait, she's downstairs. Were you aware that Balthazar, the guru of reason, maintains secret chambers in Anhasa and Kajar? You do best to speak to the queen of the gurus if you wish to learn of the mammoth mammon machine in the ocean palace. But just between you and I, it's not a place I not place much faith in any answers her majesty gave you right now. She's been different as of late. Gee, I wonder why. All right, hang on. Let's get over here. The queen's two children, Lady Shala and Lord Janice, got along so well. If only young Lord Janice would open up to others. That pendant of yours. It looks like Lady Shala's, but it doesn't glow like hers. Hmm. Wait, the conundrum. A uh, mystery? Conundrum? Words? What's over here? Wait. That's downstairs again. No, it's not. It's upstairs. Oh, my God. This place is confusing. The Queen's Council, Council, Lord Dalton, was in charge of the Ocean's Palace construction until a wandering prophet arrived and took over. Lord Dalton's in a foul mood these days. Best to avoid him if you can. Yeah, about that. I already met him. The completion of the Ocean Palace will secure everlasting glory for the Kingdom of Zeal. There will be no more fear or sadness. Sadness. Only eternal peace. I'm so sorry. I cannot read today. You'd think all the coffee that I had would have done something for me, but nope. The Queen must have been born in great must have borne a great deal of pain and sorrow in silence. Progress requires equal sacrifice. Much must have been given to allow zeal to attain the glory it knows now. Hello. This way we'll take you to the bench chambers. Okay. Gotta be a reason I'm in here. Let's talk to him. Hello. Lady Shala's pendant was made from the same red stone as the Mammon machine. When she prays to the device, the pendant glows with an unearthly light. Hmm. Okay. Let's check this side, then. Shala! Oh, Janice, you've returned. Is something wrong? The black winds. You feel the foreboding, too? Don't worry, it will be alright. Here, keep this close. What is it? It's an amulet containing my prayers. If something should happen, it will keep you safe. I wish that I could remain with you always, but Mother has other plans. That's not our mother. She looks like her, but she's not the same inside. Even still, forgive me, Janice. Pardons, your highness. Oh, different person. 
The Queen requests your immediate presence at the Ocean Palace. Very well. Well then, Janice. I must be on my way. Oh, who might you be? Forgive me, my lady, but we must hurry. If we're late, I fear we'll... I'll be... Well, you know the Queen. Oh, of course. My apologies. Go away. Oh, I'm sorry. Can I read your book? No. Any chests? No. Okay, well, fine. What about your cat? Don't waste your time. Alphador only likes me. That is like an awesome name for a cat. Okay, so is there anything in... We, we already went in here. Right. Okay. Well, let's try this side then. No, wait. This side? No, this side. I am so incredibly lost right now. I want to be the wind, Masa. Hey, it's Masa. Hey. Oh, you will someday if you try hard enough. Our big sister Doreen went to Inhasa again. Oh, she's your sister. Yeah, she likes to dream. I like the wind better than dreams. Whoosh. Okay. Even Balthazar, who designed the Blackbird in the Ocean Palace, has vanished. How strange that the three gurus who guided Zeal is to... It, to its present glory have all disappeared at once. Yeah, it is strange. To say that Gaspar, the guru of time, continues his work on some deserted island, he strives to make a time egg or some such nonsense, but no one has seen him for years. Have I talked to you? I'm so lost right now. Yeah, I did. Okay. I just didn't go up the stairs before. This way leads to the Memon machine chamber. Do I want to go there? The prophet's aura is clouded with hatred and sorrow. If he does not free himself of those emotions, he'll destroy himself and those he loves along with him. Beyond lies the Mammon machine chamber. You can feel the glorious energy of Lavos surging from it. See, that's their power, by the way. Lavos. Is that, does that sound like a good idea to anyone? Doesn't sound like a good idea to me. Came to see it? Yes. I thought as much. Can you feel the flow of the mighty Lavos' power? Oh, it brings tears to my eyes. Well, it brings tears to my eyes, too. <sighs> okay. This is the front, the font of Zeal's power, the Mammon Machine. It draws the mag and mag magnifies the limitless power of Lavos. You know what? I'm actually wondering. I want to go to the Queen's Chamber first. Because I'm not sure if I'm supposed to. Hello. This way leads to the queen's chamber. Well, now we know how to open these doors. Her majesty said she had business at the ocean palace. None may pass until her return. Your pendant, it looks identical to Lady Shala's. I heard when Lady Shala communes with the mammon machine, her pendant glows with a strange light. Yeah, so we can try that. Door cannot be opened from the outside, save with a powerful magic key that, like, Lady Shala's pendant. Your pendant looks identical. Okay, well. No. Hmm, it won't budge. This door appears to be a highly effective security system. Yeah. Okay, figured that would have been too easy. Okay, well, unfortunately, I'm going to have to end here. I know I didn't accomplish a whole lot because I spent so much time not recognizing what wind and water looked like. Um, so I will pick this up next time. I might actually try and do a couple extra episodes of this during the week, um, just so it doesn't take me so long to finish the game. But um, I'll have to see how much time I have. Uh, this past week was a little bit busy, so I didn't quite have time to do that. But I might next week. So keep an eye out. Like I said, I might start posting this throughout the week just so I can finish it up. And uh, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed watching me be confused. And I will see you next time. Bye.